Mona, 16 days left of Christmas to give you some gift ideas. You can still get in time for Christmas. They're all things that I've had before or seen. I don't have them all with me, so the ones that I don't have with me, I will post up. We're gonna get right into this video today because I still have to pack. I'm leaving in the morning. I'm filming this late for Houston in the morning. And then my two weeks of travel begins. So I'm gonna be slow probably responding to comments for the next couple of weeks. I'll try to heart them to let you know that I've seen them. Just know that I want you to still comment, give me your thoughts because I may be reading them in a taxi or in an Uber, and it just may be making my travel just a little more pleasant and palatable. Okay, so the first thing is novelty socks. I don't think any of us can really get enough of socks, and they have the cutest socks available. So what I like to do, and I did this for the ladies that I work with, get a pair of cute socks like one that says, if you can see me, you know, bring me some wine, or if you can read this, bring me some coffee, or I'd rather be watching football. A really cute pair of socks. Use it as a stocking, but it's a smaller stocking, right? Because it's a sock. So you take the one sock, you roll the other sock up at the bottom of that sock. So you have the pair, but you're only giving them one. Inside, you can put, if it's a girl, like some bath bombs, ink pens if it's a college student, a couple of those clear nail files that you can get, the the ones that are like silicone-y with a little sleeve. You know, you can use it as a miniature little gift that doesn't cost a lot, but that comes packaged in a nice way. Or you can fill it with a gift certificate, like a $25 gift certificate to the movies or for gas or to Walmart or to a restaurant or a Starbucks. And then you tie it with some curly ribbon. So it's just a cute way to present an inexpensive gift. Number two, I am in love with the cute beanie hats. Everybody's getting a beanie hat for me this year. I know they've been around, it's not like they're, they're new, but they're just getting cuter and cuter with their designs. So I'm in love with that trendy slouchy beanie hat <coughs> and the ones with the pom-pom too. So the one I'm showing you today is a little bit more expensive, but it's under 25, maybe 23 or something. I'll post all the items, all the links, and all the prices in the description. Item number three, Yeti cups in a smaller capacity, not those big, I think they're 12 ounce or 13 ounce. These are more like for your coffee size, but if you're like me, you start to sip a cup of coffee, but by the time you're getting to the bottom of it, it's already cold. So these are just coffee cups, but they're insulated, they're Yeti brand, they're nice. They're $24.99 on Amazon, and I've purchased a couple of those. I think they make also a very great gift. Number four, big blanket and pillow combo. So this would be for your younger adult, your teenager, your chi child, or, a smaller adult or an adult who just wants it in the form of a throw and not like a blanket for your bed size. The one I'm showing up is one that I'm getting for my niece. She is um, autistic and she suffers with some conditions that I think a weighted blanket would bring her some comfort. So this one has the girly print pink with the little leopards and it comes with the matching pillow but you can also get them in multiple colors on Amazon. So you can get them in solid blue or solid gray. You can get them in boy colors, girl colors, or prints. So it could be for a child. It could be for a teenager. It could be for a small adult, or it could be for a regular size adult who just wants to use the weighted blanket as a throw on the sofa and not those full size. These are much more affordable than most of the weighted blankets and it's very cute. Five is just an ornament, uh, an ornament with the year on it. So every year I get my neighbors an ornament with the year. So after years of living by me, they'll have a whole tree of nice ornaments that you pay a little more for because you're buying a single one with the year. I'm putting up this year's example of the one that I'm giving out. It's actually made of 
real fresh trees that they cut and slice so no pattern is exactly the same. And then they tie it, you know, with ribbon and paint the year on it. You can get them customized too. And on Amazon, it's not too late to get them with the family's name on them and still get them delivered by Christmas. And I also got, like I said, my son one for his first home. So ornaments are nice because they can be collectibles. And so if you take time and pick out an ornament that is unique to that person and you give them one with their gift or one as a gift every single year, then that's something that over time can build a very nice collection. Number six is the Sherpa hoodie blanket. So this is another thing that I am obsessed with. It's these Sherpa feeling blankets. They're making them shorter. So these are wearable outside, not just inside for watching TV or whatever. So it comes with a hood. The zip up, the one I'm gonna show you, has pockets and you can wear it inside, wear it to a ball game. So I think these are perfect for college students who are going to ball games or sporting events in the cold. It is good for an adult who wants to run to the store. They're not dressy, but they're definitely something that you could wear to travel. I'm gonna be wearing mine on the plane next week to Boston. It's gonna be cold there. It's gonna be cold when I get off. So it's not something, you know, I can have the blanket while I'm on the plane to cover me and then I don't have to worry about trying to shove it down in a suitcase when I land. I can just keep it zipped up on me. So there's a variety of types, but I'm gonna link this particular one that's my favorite down below. Seven is a power bank. Now this is just, I can't emphasize enough, There, there's nobody I can't think of who uses cell phones who wouldn't appreciate one of these. It's a power bank that can really charge a lot of different devices and it has a lot of power so it lasts a long time without needing a recharge. It's perfect for traveling through airports for anybody who you know who's on the go. It's perfect for teenagers who are streaming music and streaming mo movies but they're not always able to plug in. It's also perfect for adults who maybe run their phone or stream their phone while they're working. Maybe they're drivers or they're, they're on the road and they're listening and they can't, they can't charge up. I just like them. I found a pink one that is really cute. And then I found a black one and these are the all in ones. That's what, what makes them unique. You can find power banks anywhere and those are all useful, but I find that I'm going to lose the cord that you plug it in with. This is all in one piece and that's what makes it special. And if you haven't had one, I'd consider even having one for yourself because I don't think you'll regret it. The other thing is the Alter Ego palette. So I ordered several of these makeup palettes. And of course, this would not be for the men in your life. Most probably this would be for the girls. Alter Ego sells these nicely packaged palettes that are dupes for Natasha Denona Denona, Huda Beauty, and different palettes. This one is a dupe of the gold palette that I'm gonna show you. I have used these, I have worn them. In fact, so they come packaged really nice. You get them from the Alter Ego website. Guess I won't be giving this one away because I just messed up the colors. See how pretty the mirror is? It's a nice mirror, and I just did that to that bottom color. They're, to me, they're just as nice as my Natasha Denona. The colors are buttery. Just trying to grab that one lightly. They do swatch darker. These are beautiful. They have uh, one that just dropped as a dupe to the Sunrise palette. I also have the Huda Beauty Nudes dupe, but they're not, they're not saying they're a dupe. They're selling their product exactly at, as is. I'm not opposed to some, I am opposed to someone taking the name of someone else's product and trying to sell it off as a dupe. These are named different things. Like this one is named Goddess and they're selling it as their palette. It is their palette. It is their formula. But if you compare the palette side to side, you can see that the colors are exactly the same. And for $15 versus 
$125 or whatever the cost of the palette that it's similar to, you could put them side by side on your eyes and you cannot tell the difference between the looks. You can get the exact same look, good quality from Alter Ego. Don't know why I'd ever pay for something if I could get it from Alter Ego. I'll put my name on the quality of this product. Very satisfied with them. Number nine, an electronics organizer. So there are a variety of these. This is one that I particularly like and use and will be packing tonight before my trip. This one has sort of plastic cover. There are some that are sleeker, not as bulky, but they don't protect your equipment as much. So this has a lot of packets, pockets. You can fit a, a large iPad in here. In fact, I have my iPad is in this side. Keeps it from getting scratched or broken during travel. So you have two pockets that would fit an iPad. You also have these pockets right here so I can put my cell phones or I can put cords. Then you have these right here where you can pin down all your cords, all your plugins or adapters. Then you have another side for more adapters you have a zip pocket and then you have this other pocket right here they sell some that have outer pockets also for easy access to your cell phones this is just one that i liked i'm going to put the link for this one down there i think that this is a great under 25 dollar or under 50 dollar because depending on the quality of the type that you get product that everybody in this technological age can use. Not just if you travel either. It's just a great way of not losing all of your plugins and your cords. Okay, number 10 is a little unique product. One piece to it. This is phone soap. It comes with, I think I dropped it when I was walking here. Yes, I did. It comes with a little pad that you can actually, cl a cleaner for your phone screen. But it looks like a tanning bed for your phone. Do you know how many germs are on your iPhone? So this sterilizes your iPhone in 10 minutes and it blinks when it's ready. You just plug it in with your USB cable and then you put your iPhone in and in 10 minutes, it's done. That's it, and it's sterilized. So if you're holding a phone against your face all day, that can contribute to acne and breakouts, and it's just, it's not clean. So, especially during flu season and cold season, these are a very unique Kichi idea. This is a, a good boss gift, something that they probably don't have, and it's called phone soap. And I just think this is, a very unique little gadget. So two bonuses that I did not include, which brings this number not to 10, but to 12. Always a nice candle. Bath and Body Works always has sales and you can get these really affordable. This is the Marshmallow Fireside. It smells so good. They have the pretty covers. They also if you don't want to spend as much as the Bath & Body Works, you can get the Home Scents from Walmart. Those smell very good as well. I've gotten those and really enjoyed those scents. Now, the other thing that I want to show you guys that I think is a great value for a woman in your life who is a makeup lover is the Pure Crystal Clear Holiday Collection. I love pure eyeshadows and I wanted to do a look with this and I wanted to give it as a gift. However, it came broken. I had ordered this one from Macy's because it was on sale. You can still get it on at Macy's at a very good price. If you could just excuse the fact 
that there's a broken piece in here and just look at it for the beauty that it is. So you can see that what, that pan right there is broken. But it's like a book, but these are very usable, unlike some books. Look at this, it's, it's compact. You see the two broken colors have gotten there, but I want you to look at the variety of the shades. You have mattes, shimmers, you have blushes, you have large pans of highlighters, you have bronzers, you have the under eyeshadow, under brow bone base, you have transition colors, blush colors, bronzer colors, outer V corners. This is, this is a beautiful palette. I'm so disappointed that it's broken, but I don't want that to detract from you considering this as a gift because I think that I think it's beautiful and I really would like another one. I have a couple of pure palettes and the quality of those pigments and the quality of those eyeshadows are really, really good. It was actually packed in bubble wrap, so we can't blame pure or the product for that. And I'm sure that if I try to call, Macy's will probably replace it, but I, I think this would be worth considering for someone in your life. I wanna say it was maybe about $30. A lot of bang for your buck in a, in a, in a palette. I'll see you in the next video. And I hope to hear from you. Bye.